I'm planning to make a covered jar. I'm Dorian Ballou, and I'm a ceramicist. At these final stages where the clay walls get really thin, you don't want to go too fast. Otherwise, you end up with a big pancake, or you end up wearing your piece if it's big. We're now trimming the piece that has dried to leather hard, and you can definitely see the results of the two colors of clay. On these pieces, I like to put texture on the surface. There it is. One big jar. Well, believe it or not, I learned this from a student. The learning, learning is reciprocal in this environment. <laughs> I see them as equals, you know, even at the beginning. We're at Lake Superior College, and my role here is to teach people or lead people into the realm of creativity and ceramics. So what I want to do is, is cut the neck of this at such an angle, and I don't know whether I should do it right now or whether I should wait to do it. It would be best if we waited till it was leather hard. Very nice. There's nothing more enjoyable for me than leading students, leading individuals to discover the voice that they have. Do you mind me talking you through this as you pull and you go just very slow? So the outside finger is actually going to push in a little bit. It's extremely exciting for me to see that discovery take place with students. So how's it going? Pretty good. Um, I had his upper half how I liked him better, but then his bottom half turned out better than the top, so I kind of had to give him a face drop just because it kind of, he, he didn't flow right. We average about 200 ceramic students a semester, so it's a busy place, and I wouldn't have it any other way. Uh, the creative energy is, is electric. I learned everything from Dorian. Dorian's my, I like to call him my Sherpa up the clay mountain. I do like to get out. I do like to go to other parts of the country or even overseas to rub elbows with other cultures. Uh, that broadens my own perspective. But really, I am happiest right here in Duluth with my family and at LSC in the ceramics program.